Hey, orange one here. So uh, let's see what we can do. Um, I think, yeah, I was just playing, so I'm pretty familiar with where we're at. Sorry if I, this is kind of a short intro. I kind of want to just get to it. There is this defender being a meanie. Um, I could, you know, fight him. Or, or I could just blast him. Because I don't, I honestly just don't want to get damaged right now. <laughs> Um, and this is a relatively easy rocket shot, maybe. If I hit that, eh, a little splash damage will probably occur, so I'll just fall back just a little bit further. Yeah, that's what I thought. Really? He survived that? What? How did you survive that? Okay, he seems to have survived multiple. His core integrity is pretty low, though. One more should do it, right? Kind of just don't. I'm kind of done playing around here. <laughs> if you can't tell, uh, we'll keep that shotgun. Our oh, what, what, what? What are you? Oh, you're a pest. That probably means there, there's more pests, right? Or my sensor ray is not showing more pests, so I think that maybe you're just the one. I don't know. We're getting kind of damaged though. Our um, our weapons. We need we need to get some new weapons. Can I? That's traps. No friendlies. Parts. No known exits. I want the parts, but I want to be able to do the parts list. I'm just curious if I. Um, I'm looking at like the one, two, three keys. Uh, where is that on here? I'm not seeing it. Sorry. It always drives me crazy when people do this. Oh, so the get item and attach is that R R? Okay, I got it. Okay. Um. Oh, there's a run button? <laughs> I should have known that. Label. Yeah, so I don't think that there's the ability to do anything that's any more specific than this. We need to just look for weapons just for a second. So just give me a second. There's a light assault rifle here. I think that's what we want. Um, there's also a heavy assault rifle right there. I am I am concerned about something just coming around the corner and just black getting me, you know. So let's get rid of that and we'll pick this up. Um yeah, I think we must have fought through like most of the enemies in this part of the on this floor, right? Let's just get a little bit more matter. And then I think the exit must be like I think around there. Given how the developers it was all about his cardinal directions, it's all about going in like a cardinal direction from the exit, and that being the best way to reliably find the way out. Uh, what do we have here? Beam rifle, nice. Um, that actually, and medium armor plating is tempting, you know. But I think that we're doing okay. Uh, we'll get rid of that. And can I do? Uh, was it? capital R. R is not working. Oh, it's because this is all full. Um, can I get that beam rifle and yeah, let's replace the just because the other thing was so damaged. I know it's um not the best item for us since it will generate heat and we're not very good at dealing with that heat. Um, the beam rifle. Actually, I think I'm not going to have it on us. Yeah, I I don't think in the last episode I ended up really saying what was really, like, bothering me. But I honestly think I'm just going crazy. Like, honestly. <laughs> like, I've been thinking about... about uh, oh, look, here's the exit. Matter pods. Uh, that looks like the mine, then. Uh, 
there's a scout though, and I'm pretty sure they didn't notify anyone, so I am gonna actually just maybe oh oops. Distress signal, they did send out a distress signal. Turn off the shotgun and shoot them. We'll see what we can maybe do. See if I can hit them, maybe. Nope. Oh, there was a targeting glitch. What? Alarm triggered. Dispatching investigation squad. Um, mines. Oh. Oh, so we get to know that it's the mines because of our uh, signal interpreter? Okay, well, I definitely don't want to do that then, from what I've heard. Uh, I'm pretty sure that something that we shot, like, blew up there. Oh, look, there's the mercenary. Um, you don't really have armor or anything. I don't see anyone else on my radio. So I think I'm just going to blast him. Yeah, dude. Reinforcements dispatched. Uh, okay. Fine by me. I don't see... Oh, there's a mercenary. Should I let him get closer? I think I should. And then I'll be able to shotgun him. Right? Uh, there's actually two of them there now? No, there's just one. I'm just getting like weird glitches on, on in the system, you know. Can I just, yeah. Can I then wait for him to get closer? Yes, I can. Cool. Easy peasy. Free matter, right? Um, how's our engine? Our engine's okay. Uh, integrity forty nine versus uh, where is it? The uh, ion engine, there we go. It's like literally the same health and just like a worse thing. Ah, oh, this scout, man. You just need to go. <laughs> yeah, they keep on like, um, oh, there's another scout there, really? Can I wait here for a second? Um, okay, these are not actually soldiers or anything. Um, are you... Are you a transporter? Transports can have good stuff in them. So I'm just curious if I break him, if I could get some stuff. Oh, there's a mercenary there. A uh, small laser. Why don't you come around the corner here, buddy? I think I'm actually going to go for these doors just because that seems like a smart move. Um, some targeting glitch. There is multiple people coming towards me. I could fight them one-on-one, -on -one or I could try and rocket them. I think I'm going to fight them one-on-one. -on -one. Can I get a shot on the watch? I don't think I can get a shot on the watchman. I'll just let the watchman keep an eye on me. Oh man, there's three of them. Yeah, I'm probably probably the right move to try and make a choke point here. Okay, kill the fighters. Did the did I destroy the uh watchman? And then I suddenly was doubting myself if they were actually called watchmen. Yeah, here you are. Yeah, we're not destroying it, unfortunately. Uh, what got dropped there? Some aluminum legs. Perfect. Shield generator. Interesting. Very interesting, actually. I didn't know that there were shields. It probably generates a lot of heat, right? And there's a heat sink here. To kind of one. Uh, that's definitely what was the, i thought it was r is it not r is it like a or something oh it's a yeah okay cool where's the other items that we were looking at yeah i think we're just gonna keep it simple for now because 
and um, stick with the legs. I'm actually going to get uh, one more good one, just in case, you know, have a spare. Um, what's this tractor beam? Oh, wow, that's that collects a lot of items there, huh? Um, I'm pretty sure we, the rules of hanging to the side doesn't really apply as it normally does. Okay, there's something there that I'm pretty sure we don't want to fight. Dang it. Yeah. Do I want to go out there? Those could be pests. I think that that thing is electrolysis chamber. I don't think this scanalyzer blows up, does it? There we go, he's down. And is that the watch watchman? It is the watchman. Another aluminum leg if we if we needed it. You know, I kinda see why the developer recommended you get the aluminum leg. There are a lot of grunts. That actually was a good call. You would expect the developer to make a good call for his game, right? Yeah, I so I think yeah I, I think what I wanted to say earlier was the thing that I'd been thinking about was kind of like fraternity fraud and oh man I've got complicated emotions around it because it's like on one hand like there is a, it is legitimate like that's not okay for a, a woman to tell someone that they're the father and then you know them not actually be the father that's that's wrong that's a crime to me and. Like that's messing with someone's ability to understand um, their reproduction. Then they're gonna make different life choices. Like, do I want to have a second kid? You know, if I knew my first kid wasn't really actually mine, I might want a second kid or a third, even. You know, it just kind of affects your whole life, and it really upsets me that um, a lot of systems actually make there be no repercussions for the the women that do this there's zero legal re repercussions and in many cases the men actually have to pay child support but that's usually if they um acted as the child's father for some period of time um even after knowing that they're not the father that's usually how it goes but there's also some feminists that are arguing that this standard should be to keep um the non-biological father paying uh you know, child support because they've um, benefited from the love of the child, which, you know, I, I, I understand that, but at the same time, <laughs> no. <laughs> like, when you have a child, it's an investment. You're putting energy and time into them. It's, it is a two-way street, but it is a lot more one way than another. <laughs> let's just say that. Um, let's go ahead and switch this out, I think, and we're going to blast you guys. Uh, maybe not. I don't know. If that blows up, is that going to kill me? A little concerned. Yeah, I'm going to hit one of these things. Can I, um... Yeah, I really should try and take them out. Nice. Um, there are a lot of them, though, it looks like. Can I... I need to be careful because I got this rocket launcher. Uh, you know what, Pest? Ah, dang it. Stormtrooper? Oh, is that an... <laughs> that must be an achievement. Right? Oh! <laughs> okay, so that killed them. That must have been what I did earlier. Let's blow up one of those things. Um, maybe we'll... No, we'll keep the beam rifle, right? The shotguns seem to be doing pretty well for us. Uh, now the question is, is are we going to get spotted? We go for that matter. I'm going to go for it. And what was this? I think, just give me a second. What? Where did we come from originally? Came from there, so I think the exit's probably around here somewhere, maybe? I don't know. Let's, uh, let's just get to the doors, and we're going to go west. That's that's the game plan. 
yeah i don't know i've been thinking about a lot it's been really bothering me that um people do that and like if you're unaware i i consider myself a social justice warrior and i've fought tirelessly within this public school system to advocate for lgbtq rights even though i'm a straight white guy and i feel a little bit betrayed that people are are using the arguments of the lgbtq community and like parenthood and what parenthood really means to do this like it doesn't feel right to me in any way it does not feel right um yeah let's let the big boy come here and so it's like you know there's proposals for oh what's this swap mode there's proposals to have mandatory paternity tests and i'm 100 percent behind that because it is it's hard to tell your partner that you want to do that, right? I don't think that anyone should have that um, that doubt eating away at them. I don't think that's right. But maybe I'm wrong. I could easily be wrong about it. And I do want to also say that the children should be cared for no matter what. And like, if you've been in that child's life, you should continue to be in that child's life, even if they're not your biological child. But you shouldn't have to pay child support. That's not okay. I'm sorry. I'm a pretty liberal dude most of the times, but not okay. Um, I think we want to actually... Um, let's get this. And we'll get that, because that's probably much, much better. And then let's have a look. We probably want to equip that and this too. These aren't my parts, are they? I feel like those are my parts. Like I like threw them on the ground or something. Uh, what was that? It's beeping at me. <laughs> um, light treads, heat sink, aluminum leg. That's um. I would like to have one more leg just in case. God, this thing is, unless we get to the next floor, going to be worthless. But if we get to the next floor, I think we'll be okay. All of our weapons are so beat up. Let's dump that. Okay, we got to be there soon, right? Ion engine, not what I was hoping for, but okay. Oh, sorry, I gotta go. All right, so sorry about that. I had to just take a little break, real life, you know. Uh, what's this? A grenade launcher? Uh, oh, that was weird. Let's go and, and pick that up. Yeah, I just had to do some real life things real quick there. Um, our rocket launcher is kind of beat up. This is a rating two. Yeah. So it's actually, oh, look, it, um, its stats get worse the more damage it gets. I did not realize that. It's kind of interesting. I think the rocket launcher will leave here and we'll keep the mini grenade launcher. That should be cool, right? I like how I can hear things opening and closing doors, essentially. Wait, what? Hold up. What? <laughs> Seriously? God, this game is brutal for me right now. I just keep on getting trapped, you know? Um, our weapons are not looking great, but I'm just going to keep on using them and hope for the best. Oh, crushing effect. Uh-oh. So they just smashed me. Component data lost. Oh, no. No auto repair found. Ah, so this guy's like really messing me up. Um, how do I run again? I think I might need to run away from these guys. I don't know if it's gonna be possible. Um, run was. God, I hope this isn't the end. It might be the end for us. There's four of them and they're smashing us. And we could probably shoot them and be fine. But if we can run away, R and arrows. Uh, is there a way for me to see? I don't know why it's telling me that there's a threat in sight. Um, 
Okay, I think I may have really just borked this, but I think these guys need to have some explosions. Um, yeah, this is gonna hurt. You ready for this? Acid. Are you ready for this? Oh god. <laughs> Uh, let's aim at that guy. There we go. Achievement system compromised. Okay. Um, yay? <laughs> if I attach these things... I don't know. That's, uh... How hurt are you right now, actually? Ah, you got a hammer, man. I really don't like this. I wish that... Let's just try and... Put the shotgun on. I mean, I could flail him. Yeah, let's get the flail out. Let's do it. Take that, buddy. Oh man, I lost my power and everything there. I mean, not everything, but that was that was bad, man. That was really bad. Now we haven't got like any cover either. Let's just take a second and just. Oh, there's so much stuff. Um, I know that says energy warning, but we've got energy and it's coming in, so we're okay. Let's get that as well. So we've got an extra engine that's in pretty good condition too. Um, I'm also, are you guys picking these things up? I don't think they are. Oh, they're laying concrete and building walls. Oh, that's kind of cool. I actually like that. That's, that's actually pretty neat. Uh, the leg. I definitely need. Oh man, we're falling apart over here. Uh, and then flight units. I think I might want to pick those up just so I've got something. That rocket launcher of ours. Is, I'm don't want that. No. Let's get that just as something, because we actually really need some some weapons. Um. I'm going to switch that out. I'm going to keep our old weapon because we need it. <laughs> oh, man. If I look at this, what's this down here? Light dreads, beam rifle. I'm going to go back down that way, I think. Um, I mean, those guys came from up there. Heat flow. Okay, so I've got, I'm warm. Why am I so warm right now? That's not gonna let me equip that. Let's just go down this way. Yeah, it's a shame that we don't have our signal anymore. That's I'm actually pretty upset about that. I think I'm gonna grab the treads in a place of the uh, our stuff so that maybe we can get some tread armor. A heat sink. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna get that. I'm totally gonna get that. And I'm gonna stick that on there too. This heavy assault rifle is just trash. Okay, heat sink. Yeah, looks good to me. And now we can actually, I mean, now that we have a heat sink, matter fused. Oh man. So we're just like losing matter there. Yeah, we're just gonna have all these crazy effects from this corruption by the looks of it. Yeah, I mean, I can get some light treads, but we're kind of full on stuff. Tell you what, beam rifle, let's get that there. A shotgun is really should be just thrown away. Okay, I think we don't really have too many options on where to go. Maybe we do, but I'm pretty sure we don't. Okay, now I'm just getting random text. Oh, my corruption's at 10%. Oh, man, that hammer. That really messed me up. Scavenger. Um, can I kill the scavenger? And I just want their parts. There we go. Uh, what was that that just opened that door? I'm a little bit scared. I think it's a uh, commercial wheel. Okay. Where, oh, where should we go? 
I, I want to say we, sh we should go up here. Um, improved targeting computer and improved light cannon. Oh, okay. What is going on with matter fuse? We're getting all kinds of corruption problems. I think you kind of need to rush through this game and that I've been waiting too long and we're getting all this corruption problems. Pretty sure that's what's happening is that we just took too long. I definitely want that. Um, I'm just trying to figure out, is it explosive? It's a light cannon. I don't think it's explosives, right? It generates a lot of heat though, I think, compared to other things. I mean, actually that generates a lot of, a lot of heat. I might, that's a, a, a one. Okay, that's um. Get rid of our shotgun. Definitely the shotgun needs to go. And yeah, we haven't even gone through the early game. I'm not very good at this right now. I mean, it's my first try, right? So gotta give myself some wiggle room. Um, Now what is this? This is an improved targeting computer. Non-melee weapons by a six. It's kind of tempting. The heat sink, though, I think is going to be more important for the weapons that we've got right now. The signal interpreter, though, is is that kind of worthless now? It's a processor, right? So I can't actually take this off, I don't think. Yeah, because it's got that little colon thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Um, well, that means... I think I'm just going to leave that improved targeting computer. Um, how are we doing matter-wise? Yeah. I'm a little bit worried about getting blitzed out here, but I'm pretty sure our armor integrity analyzer. That is interesting. Oh. Bypass armor. That's that's a cool one. I like that. Oh, uh, what are, what was that? Why is that guy flashing? Yeah, I'm confused. All right, so I don't know how much longer I'm going to record it because it got broken up into mul multiple sessions. I'm not really sure how long this is going to go, but I'm a little bit worried about all of our corruption. Um, yeah, I think the exit, it's got to be around here somewhere, man. Is it up here or is that? That's where we came from, kind of. Uh, I kind of don't like being out in the hallway if I, we don't have to be. Let's just cut across like that to here. Yeah. Yeah, I, I need to be a little bit less cautious, I'm pretty sure. Um, okay, so I think we're kind of in the right area now. Oh, look, there's a sentry. Hello. Um, can I blow him up? is my question. Or should I even try to blow him up? I wonder, where are my chances? 60, 60, yeah, I mean, the light the light cannon is the cannon. I just, I'm not sure if it's gonna hurt me or not. Okay, so the miss, miss, hit. So the cannon did hit, but he also hit me. Uh-oh, our heat sink's pretty much done. Let's build. That's not good. I'm pretty sure he hit our heat sink. Oh no. How are you doing? Your core integrity is full. Okay, well I'm not doing this then. Um let's switch this out for the grenade launcher. And I'm going to just back up and I think just do the grenade launcher and the cannon. No, let's let's do all of them. Oh no, I can't actually hit him. Um, can I, I'm just gonna turn this and this off then for that shot and just aim like right there. That should have done some some good amount of damage there, right? He's got full core integrity. How is that possible? <laughs> can I turn these on now? Yeah, I'm gonna just take the risk. Oh man, I just don't have like any real utilities is the problem. Oh no! 
the targeting targeting data glitch. Oh my god, my target. I'm not even hitting my tar targets. What's this? Is this uh? That looks like a maybe something that I want to go pick up. Looks like some good gear that we're gonna need. At least our corruption's not gone up, right? <laughs> that beam rifle, though. Now I'm I'm getting really nervous about the beam rifles. Let's uh let's switch them out. Let's just get that, and then I'm gonna actually do the same thing with this one. And field recycling unit. What does that do again? Um, I don't think we really want to do that unless we want to just like go like bananas with the grenade launcher. And our grenade launcher is kind of hurt. I mean, it's a utility that I, I I'm gonna just pick it up and attach it just because I don't really know what else to do. Um, actually, yeah. And then let's go get that shotgun again. And the tractor beam is also a utility, right? And that could bring in another to us. You know, I think that we can... Uh, is that in good condition? That is. I don't think that we need it, though. Let's get rid of the beam rifle, though. So if I wait there... Yeah, okay, so recycling four matter. Okay, that... That was not a whole lot of matter. Yeah, I don't know if that's that's worth it. I don't think that it really is. Um, what is this over here? Is this a little hallway? Can I look in here? Because I've got a feeling that exit is around here. And I really want to get out of this level. <laughs> if I can. Uh, the surf. Uh, let's not do that. Um, look at the shotgun. <laughs> Did I actually kill them? I don't think I actually killed them. I don't know. I might have. What is this? Grenade launcher. I kind of. Ooh, terrain sc scanner. That. Sounds remotely useful. Let's switch out this field recycling unit. I don't really like that. Uh, terrain scanner. Put that on here. Oh, that's kind of cool. Okay, so we'll get to see the surroundings. I like that a lot, actually. That's actually super cool. So if I go up here, can I see what's around me? Not really. Okay. Oh, no, do not collide with them. You don't need to. Come on. Oh, man. All right, this guy. Should I grenade launch him? I mean, it's going to kind of waste his components, right? But it's going to do a lot of damage. <laughs> Just go for it. <laughs> He's pretty much dead. Um, No grenade launcher this time, then. There we go. You know, I do like that cannon. It's actually pretty cool. Heat sink. Oh, it's a proper heat sink. I'll pick that up. We're not really built for it, but I'll use it. And I'm pretty sure we're getting to uh, where we're trying to go. Um, I don't have the grenade launcher. That's good. Construction. Oh, okay. You're sending in the troops. Huh? Oh, there's the mercenary. I don't think I'm going to get a shot off before they get up close and personal, so let's just get the shotgun out. I'm just going to wait here for a little bit. Yep, there you are. Can't shoot you yet. Okay, yeah, this should devastate them pretty good. Oh, there's two of them. Matter warning. Okay, so we need, need to be a little bit careful with our matter. Hopefully we'll get a good amount from these guys. Oh, what? Okay, cool. 
that must be our exit that we were, we've been looking for. Oh, I can shoot you. Can I just let you get a little bit closer then? Actually, I just want you to be right up close. Uh, yeah, that looks good. Oh man, what did he just destroy? Uh, my train scanner? Really? You jerk. <laughs> Here we go. Um, aluminum leg, we definitely need that. I'm gonna just get the matter though, real quick. Um, we do have a spare engine. Okay, uh, leg then. Uh, A? Yes, that's good. And then what else did we get? A wheel... Um, there's another good alu aluminum leg there. And I think I'm gonna m maybe just keep this one as a spare. I'm not really sure. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. We got rid of the beam weapons. I, I know the heat sink's in good shape, but it's a balancing act, man. Can I... Um, yeah, you're in my way, Surf. Can I, instead of wasting all of my matter, can I just shoot you with like a single shotgun? Oh, it actually killed the surf. Oh, cool. <laughs> I did not think that was actually going to kill him. Just kind of wanted to get him out of the way. Um, and then A, I do really do need a utility. So if there's anything, there's a structural scanner. Could actually attach the heat sink. Um, And we have had a lot of issues with heat. Let's just get this though. I don't know what it does. Oh, right. Actually, I do know what that does. Have we seen that before actually? Uh, shotgun, don't really need that. Let's actually turn on our other weapons. And I think that we are just about to the point where I would feel comfortable ending this episode. I know someone else was saying, why do you do half an hour videos? It's just kind of a nice, nice amount for me. Ooh, prototype energy gun. Did you hear that sound effect? Substantial component data lost. Uh, that doesn't sound good. I'm going to definitely get that and I think attach it. No free slot. Uh, ba -ba -ba. God, we're so close to actually being able to use that storage unit. Um, can I attach it? Yeah, okay, let's, uh, let's just attach it. Let's see what we get. Imperial, m improved, not Imperial. Uh, rating two. That doesn't seem worth it to me. I think I'm gonna keep the shotgun. Uh, yeah, let's keep the shotgun. And I'm actually just going to grab that as our backup mode of transportation in case we need it. Um, and let's get the last of the matter, too. That's that's pretty bad. Unknown wheel. That's funny. Um, yeah, the one thing that I would maybe want to do is get more matter. That is concerning. I might... No, I don't think we should go back. I think we just need to move on and, and head up. Yeah, I'm going to do it. Um, materials. Yeah, this is the final stage. Okay, I'm going to go there. And... I'm going to go with anomaly detected. That is that because my corruption? <laughs> Pretty sure it is. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm totally corrupted. That's awesome. I love the corruption effects in this game. That's so cool. Like, honestly, like really, really cool. Um, I don't know if this is really gonna, oh, nope, never mind. That is the worst thing ever for me. Let's get these legs all on. And do I have another weapon? Do I have my grenade launcher? I'm gonna put that on, but disable it just so that when I start up the next Part, I don't just completely butcher everything. Um, in any case, thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.